Hey guys, it's me, Seren, back with another video. It is day 24 of Hidden Figures, and I want to go ahead and preface by saying that they are doing more work outside of my apartment, um, so bear with me. It's not quite as loud. They were, like, really going ham earlier, but I think they're, like, winding down now, so hopefully it won't be too distracting. Um, today's Hidden Figure is Donna August, who was born 1958 and is an African-American businesswoman, entrepreneur, and philanthropist. She was the founder and chief executive officer of Freshwater Software from 1996 to 2001. And prior to Freshwater Software, she was a senior engineering manager at Apple who helped to coordinate the development of the personal digital assistant or PDA. So like the lead on the development of the PDA at Apple was this black woman. First and only is a familiar phrase to Donna August, as she was the first member of her family to graduate from college. She was also the first black woman to enter the PhD program in computer science at Carnegie Mellon University. And in her chosen field, one dominated by white males, she is a definite rarity. Donna August was born in Texas, but relocated to Louisiana and then to Berkeley, California. She and her three sisters were raised by their single mother. And since an early age, August loved to tinker with things from taking apart doorbells to disassembling toasters and other electrical appliances. After graduating from high school, she enrolled in the Electrical Engineering and Computer Science program at University of California, Berkeley, where she overcame many obstacles to earn her undergraduate Bachelor of Science degree in electrical engineering and computer science. She did graduate study in computer science at Carnegie Mellon University, where she earned her master's degree in 1983. Excuse my emails. You know those things are always going off and dinging. While conducting research at Carnegie Mellon University, August interned at Xerox Corporation's Palo Alto Research Center and met the future founders of IntelliCorp. August was hired by IntelliCorp as a software engineer in 1986 to work on technology products that incorporated artificial intelligence. After spending four years at IntelliCorp, August took a break from work for two months to bike through Japan's countryside. Like, what? Amazing. Upon her return, August was hired by Apple Computer in 1990 to serve as lead software engineering manager for the PDA development project. While at Apple, August was well-liked and won praises for her managerial skills as well as her technical contributions, and she holds various patents for her work on the PDA, like Black Women Inventors, hello. In 1996, August relocated to Boulder, Colorado and joined U.S. West Advanced Technologies as Senior Director of Multimedia Systems Engineering and Development. While working on interactive television applications for the company's fiber optic broadband network, August foresaw the potential of the internet and launched her own company, Freshwater Software Inc., as a provider of software solutions for maintaining and monitoring web applications. Freshwater Software grew rapidly from a tiny startup to a nationally recognized multi-million dollar software provider, which boasted Fortune 500 clients such as AltaVista, IBM, Microsoft, and Merrill Lynch. In 2001, she sold Freshwater Software to Mercury Interactive Corp for $147 million. In the same year, she was recognized as one of the 25 women who are making it big in small business by Fortune Magazine. She also won the 2001 Golden Torch Award for Outstanding Women in Technology. Upon retiring, after the sale of Freshwater Software, August founded the Leave a Little Room Foundation, LLC, a philanthropic organization that helps provide housing, electricity, and vaccinations to poor and underprivileged communities around the world. She is a Catholic and a member of the Cure Diars Parish in Denver, where she is co-director of the Children's Choir and oversees a recording studio for gospel artists. In 2008, August was diagnosed with lupus, and she also works to raise awareness around around the disease. Just like a really incredible and amazing, just like multifaceted woman. Uh, and the quote that I want to read you guys from Donna August is, when we share our talents and gifts with individuals and communities around the world, amazing things happen. Donna August, a hidden figure. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.